Well, supporters who want to save the building that once housed King Records could get a big boost today. Cincinnati City Council members are expected to give the building a new title, Historic Landmark. And Local 12's Perry Shively joins us now with more on what this means. And good morning, Perry. Hey, good morning to you, John. Basically, what it means is there can be no significant changes made to the building after that designation. Now, the building behind me here in Evanston may not look like much. There are broken windows, some windows that are boarded up. But if these walls could talk, they would have a lot to say because this is the building that once housed King Records. Big name artists recorded here and made some great music in this building. Hall of Famers from both country and R&B music like James Brown and Bootsy Collins. Now, the owners of this building want to knock it down, but today Cincinnati City Council may save it on the agenda at their meeting this afternoon. Council members will discuss an emergency ordinance to dedicate 1540 Brewster as a historic landmark. Supporters say that title is well deserved as King Records helped break down racial barriers. And outside the building here next to I-75, they have a historic marker out here. You can see that it gives a little bit of the history there, but pretty soon if this designation goes through, there's going to be another marker saying historic landmark. Guys, back to you. All right, Perry, thank you for that. And the meeting starts at 2 o'clock at City Hall, and of course, Local 12 will have that covered for you.